Yo guys, welcome back to another video. Now today I'm going to be showing you how you can mesh most of the centre map, if not the whole of the centre map, if you do avoid all the roots and stuff like that. Uh, now the coordinates for this is actually at uh, 45.9 and 63.2, and this is the location of the map um, right here. Now someone has actually posted this before me, um, but it was a different method. Their method is unofficial and mine is official, but I'll leave their credits down below in the description anyway, because uh, they did actually upload it before me, but you know. Uh, but for this, what you are going to need is a Pelagonis with a uh, saddle on and a cryopod. You also are going to need crossbow and um, zip lines, and you are also going to need narcotics for this method. Now, if you do want to do the unofficial method, uh, you will need a cliff platform and a sleeping bag instead of the um, crossbow and the uh, zip lines. Uh, so, what you are going to do is cryopod the Pelagonis with the platform uh, with the saddle on. Sorry, not platform saddle. And then once you've actually got all the requirements and you've got the uh, Pelagonis cryopodded, what you are going to, want to do is actually go ahead and make your way to the um, mesh hole. Uh, now what you are going to, want to do is actually go up the um, stairs, as you can see here, and then actually go through this archway. And once you actually do come from the archway, come down the first flight of stairs, and to the right you'll actually see this little hole, as you can see there. Uh, once you actually hit this hole, what you are going to need to do is drink the narcotics or eat the narcotics, whatever you want to call it, and run forward while you are obviously taking the narcotics. And then what should happen is your character will knock out, and once you actually do wake up, you will be on the opposite side of this um, border. And then you'll actually be able to do the next part of this glitch. Now, I've also got a Discord server, the link for that's in the description down below. If you do want to join that, um, it's really helpful, obviously, if you are needing help with glitches and stuff like that. And also, if you actually do comment KHYT, I'll actually uh, heart your comment and give your uh, comment a reply. Um, but once you actually are through the um, opposite side of these stairs, as you can see here, you can't actually run out um, while you are crouched, obviously, through this opposite side of here. Uh, but So if you are going to get out, what you'd have to do is do the sleeping bag method, or actually just come through the uh, mesh hole and go out that way. And what you're going to do is just drop down this second hole, as you can see here, the coordinates uh, for the actual hole, it was on the screen right there. And then once you are actually at this part, what you are going to want to do is get your um, crossbow and your zip lines, and um, try and shoot in the same spot where I shoot now. Now, the first time you might not actually get this, it might say zipline blocked or uh, something like that. Uh, but as you can see, this spot where I did shoot does actually let you through. Now, once you actually hit the second or the third hole, whatever you want to call it, uh, once you actually hit this bottom hole, what you are going to do is get the Pelagonis and the Cryopod and actually throw it out and um, try and get it to the back wall or, or close to the back wall as possible. Um, and then if you do that, that's like it, will, it should let you ride and give you the option to ride it. And obviously, uh, you're about to go through there. Because as you can see, where I did throw it now, it didn't actually let me on it, as you can see, because it's too far out. So what you're going to do is try and make it closer to the wall, if that does make sense. As you'll see in the next clip in a minute. Um, but it is super easy once you actually get it in the right spot, obviously. Then you, then you can just ride it, and then you can actually go through the mesh, and uh, mesh the whole of the map, and stuff like that. Uh, but as you can see here, now I've actually got the Pelagonis in the right spot. All you have to do is actually press uh, Y to actually ride it on Xbox. Uh, and then once you... Uh, so once you've actually got onto the Pelagonis, you are actually through the mesh then, and you'll see in the gameplay in just a second uh, that you can actually just swim uh, through the um, hole on the map, basically. And you've just got to try and avoid all the kill barriers and teleportations there, because obviously if you do hit them, you're obviously going to get teleported and stuff like that. But as you can see, once you're actually through this last hole, what you're going to want to do is actually just go through this uh, little bit here, as you can see that entrance. And then you're actually fully through the um, mesh now, and you can obviously mesh the whole of the map. Now, just be careful, if you do stop flying underneath the map, as you'll see in the gameplay in just a couple of seconds, you'll actually get um, teleported. So just try and swim uh, as much as you can, because you can see as, as soon as I start flying, uh, this is when I get teleported. So if you can just try and um, swim all the way, that will be helpful, obviously, for you. And um, that's just a, a tip I can give you to avoid that kill barrier or the teleportation zone or whatever you want to call it. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching. If you could like and subscribe, I hope this has helped you all out and I hope you actually enjoy. And like I said, my Discord server, um, the link for that's in the description down below. And it's worth actually trying it out.